We begin with that developing story regarding Green Bay's coal piles. The state assembly voted in favor of spending $5 million to remove the coal piles from the base of the Mason Street Bridge at the banks of the Fox River. As Local 5 News first reported, there was a groundswell of bipartisan support for the funding measure, which was written by Republican David Steffen, who represents Green Bay. It allows Wisconsin to reallocate federal recovery money as a down payment to get rid of the coal piles. The Haley's Comet of Economic Development Opportunities. These are routine terms that are used to describe this project. Now, it's not unusual in politics and media to use hyperbole to describe issues and actions that are occurring in our daily and community lives. But in this situation, it truly is the case. The $5 million is focused on water treatment and other environmental preparation work. Some estimates say it will cost as much as $30 million and take four more years to once and for all get rid of the coal piles.